On this episode, I'll be talking about one-way visions, why we have so many different grades, and why they're all important for different jobs, and how we can make the most of the product. If you've ever been by the Federal Electricity and Water Authority building in al or maybe you've even seen our recent poster on our social feed, it's a project, a graphic branding project, which was done by our, one of our oldest customers, Salim Jacobson. They did a one-way vision branding on the building, on the glass facade of the building, a certain section of it. They branded it with the FIVA logo and uh, information about uh, the FIVA authority. So this is a very prestigious building, obviously, a ground building. And they used the ContraVision product, 40% see-through product for that application. Especially with one-way vision, there are so many different types available, even from us and in the market. So what's really important about one-way vision is not just the effect of the branding or the visual when they put it up, but also when it is going to be taken off. Depending on when it is going to be taken off, if it is a few months or maybe longer than a year, it's important to use the right one-way vision. In, say, the FIBA building, they're probably planning to have that branding there for over a year, maybe even longer than two years. And with very economical one-way visions, what will happen after one year or longer is that when you try to peel that off, it will come off in little bits and pieces because the PVC will start to degrade and crack and it's impossible to come off in a single piece or in bigger pieces. And it will end up leaving a lot of residue on the glass, a lot of uh, damage and burn marks from the PVC onto the glass. And there is a, a significant work just to clean that surface area. And as a sign maker, you have to keep take that into account because most likely you will be asked to clean that glass or once uh, you have to change the branding. And that can be a significant cost involved when you're talking about a, sky, a large building or a skyscraper where you need uh, access with uh, the cradles that go up and down. And that's a significant cost, way more than uh, one-way vision cost or how much the printing cost. So uh, I'll break down some of the advantages of different products. So starting off at the bottom level is a very standard one-way vision. It's made of PVC. It uh, has two layers, obviously the, the liner and the filling which you print down with the holes. All standard one-way one -way visions have a 30% see-through, which is a good balance of having image impact and visibility from the inside so that you can see outside. And uh, the starting level, the economical products from us or others, it's usually around the 120 or 140 micron range in thickness of PVC, ours is 140. And we really recommend it for applications where you're going to remove the, the, the film in less than six months. It's ideal for even a couple of days promotions, um, but anything less than six months, you use this product, it should be fine for taking it off the glass with minimal residue and coming off in uh, big, big pieces. But if you can go one step up, we have the UV one-way vision. We call it the UV one-way vision, but it is compatible also for latex, for uh, eco-solvent printers, but it's a more premium product because it is a 160 micron product. And the advantage here is that it's thicker, so the PVC will degrade much slower, ideally for applications where you will take it down uh, longer than six months, in between six months and one year, it is ideal. And it's UV one, we call it UV one way vision because unlike the other product, it has three layers. It has an inner layer in here, which is uh, important for UV printers because when you print on the surface of the, of the media, the ink would depo deposit in the holes and harden, and then you would not have the see-through effect. So with the inner layer, in, inner layer, you can just peel that back and all the hardened ink will pull off with that inner layer and you still have the same see-through without any of the holes being blocked. So this is great for the UV printers, it is great for eco solvent printers, and especially for applications where you're gonna keep it on the glass for longer than a year. It's thicker, so it'll be easy to take it off when you're doing the changing of branding without any of the cleanup work that's required for uh, applying a new product. Because obviously when you put a new, new branding on that glass, it has to be perfectly clean so that it adheres well. And obviously then there's the top of the line product, which is the contravision. This is especially great for these uh, large scale product, uh, projects which are going to be uh, visible for, uh, longer, for longer than a year. The, the, the film itself in the contravision is not monomeric like the other products, it's polymeric. So it has much better durability outdoors. Additionally, it's 160 micron. And because it's polymeric, it doesn't shrink. All other vinyls which are monomeric tend to shrink. You will, it will start to reduce in size. 
So when you use a one way vision that's from contravision, they don't need to do an overlap, they just do it edge to edge and there would be no issue from it uh, shrinking and creating a gap. But with all the other the earlier two products I mentioned, you have to overlap because as it shrinks, it sh the, the image should still have that impact and be visible. So this is a very important technique and advantage with contravision. In addition with contravision, you have so many other options, not just the durability and uh, removability after longer than a year. Even up to three years, you would have great removability of the product from the glass. But you have different options like 20% transparency and 40%. Like these images, you can see the image impact of a 20% and a 40%. Obviously, the 40% is less, but this is important for certain applications where they need higher see-through from for the people looking from uh, inside the building to outside, and especially important in like transit applications uh, like a bus or uh, moving vehicles, w uh, trains, where for safety factor, they would prefer that people have better visibility from inside to outside and lower image impact. And other places where that is not important, you can go with the 20% transparency, higher image impact. And apart from that, there are many other products like backlit application, clear products from ContraVision. So depending on your project, it's very important to not just think about the cost of what are the different uh, costs of the material, but what are the additional costs you might incur in the project, like cleaning, like removability, the time it takes to remove uh, one version can be extremely uh, painful if you use, say, the very economical product and put it up for a year is, or even longer than six months, it is going to be extremely painful and expensive to remove it. So we can advise you so, or which product to use. I hope this video also gives you some in, information on which is the right product to choose. Otherwise, you can uh, get in touch with us. And these products are also available on the BlueRind.store website. And we hope you'll get in touch and buy them soon. Thanks for watching. Hope it was interesting. Please make sure to comment on this video what your feedback is on the product or any questions you have. Look forward to answering them soon.